delighted that we ran into Gina here at the Romance Writers Conference. Me too. And we're going to let Gina tell us a little bit about her upcoming books, including a new young adult novel that's part of Harlequin's new line that we're pretty excited about. I'm very excited about it. The title is Intertwined, and it's about a 16-year-old boy who has four human souls trapped inside of his head. So everybody thinks <laughs> he's crazy, but he's not. Um, these souls have abilities of their own. They can time travel and possess other bodies and raise the dead and predict the future and have even predicted his death. So a lot going on in the book, no a lot kidding. of fun stuff. So I'm very excited. It's an August 25th release and I wrote it for my own kids and um, so I'm very, very happy with That's it. Great. How old are your children? I have a 13-year-old son and a 12-year-old daughter. And so have they read this yet? They have. They really, really enjoyed it. So. That's great. What's the, what's the point of view? It's, I have multiple points of view. Uh, Aiden, the boy, is the main one. And then there's a girl, Marianne, who has his opposite power. She actually repels the supernatural while he draws it. So this is very exciting. Yeah, it's, it's a teen romance. So. so now the Vatican just came out and endorsed the new Harry Potter movie. Excellent. So it's a, it's a real step forward for the yeah. Vatican. So how do you think the Vatican would react to Intertwine? Hopefully they'd love it. Hopefully they'd endorse it. <laughs> so we'll, we'll contact Rome yeah, for endorsement. Yeah, yeah, send them a the coffee. <laughs> <laughs> um, so the uh, age group, the ideal age group for the... Uh, you know, I actually point? wrote this book. Um, anybody can pick it up. No matter your age, you can pick it up and, um, and read it. Teens, adults. Will it be a series? Yes, there will be four books in the series. And uh, we're calling it the Intertwined series. So. Now we know you write fast, so how yeah. long will it take to get the four books published and available? We are going to do one book a year in this series. So um, Intertwine comes out this year, Unravel will come out next year, and I don't have titles for the other two yet. Have you sold the movie rights yet? Not yet, but we're lucky. <laughs> that would be great. So I, I probably shouldn't ask you who the ideal people would be to play the characters because they're going to probably be new and young. Uh, Selena Gomez, I think, would make a wonderful Mary Ann. I've already got her picked out. That's <laughs> so, great. <laughs> Victoria Justice, maybe, for Victoria. Yeah. How about the, the guy, eh? The boys, um, I'm not sure about. I don't know. So maybe uh, Taylor Lautner for um, Aiden. Very good. So. For the young actors out there, this is an opportunity to start planning your audition for the, <laughs> the movie series Intertwined. Excellent. So, shifting subjects a little bit, how about uh, your titles for adults? Um, at the same time, I have um, my next Lords of the Underworld novel coming out, The Darkest Whisper, which I'm very excited about. It's Saban's story, and he's the keeper of the Demon of Doubt. So. Well, at Books on Board, we get a lot of excitement about your paranormal. Excellent. Well, right before The Darkest Whisperer, we're having a releasing an, an e-book called The Darkest Prison. Okay. So, it'll be available and, and, as download only. And where's right a great place for people to buy their e-books? Books on Board, absolutely no question. <laughs>